So we got a few magnets in uh, for magnet fishing, and this is a new venture. We haven't uh, we haven't been the the magnet fishermen. Normally, it's real fishing, fishing for fish. Uh, as on my prior video, we're going to be using the lavalier microphones. Uh, hopefully, they hold up, and we're able to keep using those. And, uh, if it's something you're interested in, I think there's a link in the prior video. If you want to purchase them, we bought them on Amazon. Cheap, cheap. Let's see. Let's look at the first one. We bought a few magnets and we bought different ones for different things. And as usual, I've been watching some other videos and I've already found two others that I want because I'm insatiable. I literally can't stop buying stuff sometimes. This kit, the... Uh, this is the, uh, this is the Uliber magnet, Uliber or whatever. Um, extremely powerful, apparently, and can uh, pinch your fingers and you know, make an owie. Let's see. Comes with gloves, a uh, set of cheap gloves, <laughs> only waterproof on one side. Let's see. It comes with a medium strength uh, written in Chinese thread locker. I, uh, I'm going to use a Permatex medium strength thread locker. It's just, uh, I know this works. I don't know if the other one works. So, this also comes with obviously a magnet. We won't stick that near my hard drive or anything. So, fairly good size. It's, uh, I held it up to a few things. It uh, picks things up fairly immediately. Uh, like washers and screwdrivers and things you can't pull them off of. But what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be removing uh, the, uh, the little eyelet here, the ring, so that I can uh, put my thread locker on and lock it in place. I may or may not use this uh, carabiner, carabiner, whatever you call it. But we will see. And, uh, I may show you my method of tying a knot on. Oh, this one also comes with a, uh, a grappler. Oh, apparently there's metal under the table. Yep, oh, yep, there's metal under the table. Oh, shit, okay, there's still metal under the table. So, I got a little grappling hook, uh, a little safety plastic thing so you don't kill yourself. Uh, what else does it have in here? Um, a Velcro for something. It comes with uh, rope. I'm not sure the length of rope it comes with. Obviously, if it's not enough, we'll change out. But I don't see it on the box. And it says it's a... Uh, there, you read it. It's a neodymium magnet. Well, there goes my reading skills out the window. Um... <laughs> Crazy. It's made in uh, China. Uh, Zenning West Road, China. It comes with a little uh, bag. Uh, I guess it would be worth using if you were going to use it. I'm going to use something different. Uh, but that's the Uliber magnet, which I don't know how good it is other than it picks stuff up and sticks to my table currently. Um, but that's it. We also ordered, and there's Chinese writing on my gloves. So I have no idea what it says. Oh, it comes with a uh, plastics uh, separator. I guess if you get something stuck on the magnet, you can't get off. Because you wouldn't want to use a metal separator, because it would also stick to the magnet. That's that one. Let's see what else we have. I just cut the top off of this thing. It comes with uh, black rope. Also another carabiner, which I'm going to tie differently. And this is a... This is a Kong Magnets. I think it's Kong. Not. King Kong Magnetics. And uh, I have no idea where it's made. Let's see. 
bought from Amazon, King Kong magnets, there is, I have absolutely no idea, it is, it is made somewhere, you'd have to look it up online, but it is uh, King Kong magnetics, but this here, this one is a double sided magnet, so it picks up from both sides, and if you, it holds on pretty well. Um, I actually think the single-sided one works a little bit better, but uh, this is supposed to be a 1,200-pound magnet, so it'd be 600 pounds on each side. I, you will have to look at the other one. I think it's a 650-pound, but this is threaded on both sides, and then you just thread lock it on whether or not you're going to be drop fishing or uh, tossing the magnet. And uh, based on what I've been watching, my next pur purchase is going to be a, a magnet that has a 360 degrees uh, magnet surface. That way, uh, no matter how you throw it, it, uh, it sticks. And I don't know about you, but my OCD cannot handle this right here the way that... Uh, the way that locks in place. So I'm gonna have to use some washers so that we end up with a nice, straight, even, yes. So, so that's it. Um, you'll see us, yeah, 1200 pounds. So when they say 1200 pounds and it's a double-sided magnet, they mean 600 pounds on each side. So uh, that's why you'll see that they're a little bit less expensive than a 1200 pound single-sided magnet. Or 360 degree magnet for that matter. Um, I guess if you want to see a good way to tie this, I'll, uh, I'll show you a tying method real quick. I still got black paint under my nails from a project I did earlier. That's it's, uh, anti sexy. There we go. Let's do like an uh, easy peasy knot if you want to see. How you would tie this on without your carabiner. Boom. Let's uh, take this. Let's do it where you've taken it and you've made a loop right here and you throw said loop through here which gives you a double contact point instead of a single and we would pull this through and let's say we were going to go under oh let's give ourselves a little bit more or we would go under through the hole and we would go around the magnet with what we let go, hold through. Whoop. And what we're going to do is we're going to just feed this tension out of here so we can get it pulled up and pulled tight. So there, that way you have a double contact point there and you can either, you can put one of those metal connectors on it if you want that, uh, that connects the rope here. Uh, some people wrap it with tape around this section. Uh, some people do another small knot up here for fear of the first knot coming loose, obviously and then putting tape under that knot so it never slides, but, you know, I'm not sure <laughs> it's coming off. I'm pulling on it, people. Um, I mean, I'm literally going to break something, not anything but myself here. Yeah, it doesn't come loose, so, so that would be, uh, that would give you a good double contact point. So instead of a single piece of rope running across here, even though it's smooth, you have uh, a little more pulling, a little more space there. So, all right, uh, hopefully that helped you out a little bit.
or help me out a little bit some. This kit, the, the, is anybody else hear a dog? I hear dogs. I'm not sure if you hear dogs, but I hear dogs. <laughs> I, I hear three dogs. You guys aren't helping me out at all. Uh, okay, this one comes with a grappling hook also. Uh, also a bag and uh, you know that's it so we'll be trying those out and uh, hopefully we'll be seeing you soon on the upcoming videos uh, and this will be uh, cash pirate talk to you soon